Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to uh, give you an idea about installing the lightweight version for your uh, alternative Chromium browser, especially if you are running with the Raspberry Pi 0W. So I'm going to use the first one, we call it as Midori. So to install the Midori, basically you can just go for the sudo apt get install Midori. Midori. So this is one of the idea that you can install the Midori on your Raspberry Pi 0W. So um, because Midori is one of the Linux uh, distributions that are very useful, especially um, you want the light version of it. So let me just try it, um, install it inside the Raspberry Pi uh, 0W and then uh, we are going to have a look what kind of output and also what kind of um, alternative approach that we are trying to have here, whether it's success or not. So just wait for a while and have a look at it. So let me just speed up a little bit so that you can have a look what kind of um, process and also how to launch it soon. Okay, so now it's already installed and uh, we are trying to um, have a look about the output after this. So let me just check the internet whether there is some um, browser. Okay, so we have the Midori browser over here. So we can try the Midori now. So this is actually a video run from the Raspberry Pi 0W. It is not a version 2, it's a, a old version, Raspberry Pi 0 2, uh, Raspberry Pi 0 version 1, 2017 version. So let me just uh, go and uh, try to have a look on the output. So let me just make it bigger a little bit. Uh, the reason of um, having the Midori or any web browsing uh, alternatively from Chromium is because we want to able uh, navigate the uh, internet uh, connection so that we can go for the website and then uh, copy the code and use uh, something like that. So this is the first trial versions um, of uh, the process. Um, hopefully it's giving uh, good feedback so uh, it's a live review for you to just have a look. Because just now I already uh, go for the Chromium, right? And then um, it is not loaded anything. But now we try to use the Midori. So hopefully it's giving um, a good feedback and can load it. We can also have the another um, alternative um, light browsing apps. Uh, for example, Midori, Epiphany. And um, we have um, more than that, which is uh, GNU IC Cat. Um, Web and so on, which is um, are going to be reviewed soon. So check it out and just wait. Let me speed up a little bit the process. Okay, so it's able to load, and then we can see over here um, it's um, using the DuckDuckGo. Hmm, still quite sometimes to load it, uh, but we try. So the um, the idea is basically use this um, Midori and then it's successfully loaded and it can um, help you to browse the internet successfully. Of course, it takes uh, quite a bit of time. Okay, until then, see you next time. Thank you for watching this video and see you again.